and I, I just wanted to make a, a video just to update you on kind of what's been going on. And I know last time I talked about, um, you know, starting the film with a GoPro and stuff, which I did actually end up getting the GoPro. I got the um, GoPro Hero 6 Black. So that, that should be good when I start filming with that. I, I found out that, you know, I have to uh, upgrade my video editor to be able to support 4K uh, videos. So, yeah, I'll, I'll do that probably around payday because it's kind of expensive. It's like $70 for me to do that because I have to update to uh, Pinnacle Studio 21 Ultimate. So, yeah. But once I do that, I'll be able to, you know, have a lot more 4K stuff. And then with the, uh, with the 4K, I'll be, you know, filming, you know, more tropical looking areas, places with a lot of colors. You know, I'm thinking about filming, you know, monks praying, things like that. You know, just just interesting things like whatever has a lot of co color and is very vivid and you know really pops on the camera. That's the kind of stuff I want to film, just because it will, uh, you know, it'll be visually pleasing to you, like a little bit of eye candy for you. But uh, yeah, I, I'm not filming just yet, and I'll still film with the iPhone. But I'm going to, you know, make sure that the the video uploads in at least 1080p with iPhone. Because I, I did read that for uh, YouTubers, the really you only need two cameras. You need, you know, a, a modern smartphone, you know, with a decent camera, which you know iPhone 6 has it and above, and also a GoPro. If you have those two things, then you're good to go. Because GoPro can you know film underwater, it can film 4K, 1080p, you know, whatever you want to film with it, and it's, it's really versatile. You can even put it on drones and stuff. And then you know for film for vlogging, of course, the, the iPhone's good for that. So probably when I'm vlogging, it will probably be more uh, 1080p, even with the uh, the GoPro. But when I when I go on location somewhere, like uh, you know, if I go to CM Reap or something, then of course that will be uh, that will be 4K. There's no reason to have 1080p if I could have 4K. So that will be what I'm trying to you know accomplish there. So it'll be a couple weeks before you start seeing 4K videos leaking out. And with the 4K, I also want to, uh, you know, kind of train myself on how to edit a 4K video because it's a little bit different than ed editing, uh, you know, lower quality videos like the resolution is lower, so it's easier to edit. But, you know, once I figure it out, you'll start seeing higher and higher quality videos. So it'll make a big difference. And I'm also going to change the introduction. The music will stay the same, but I'm going to make the introduction, uh, you know, in HD just to, you know, match the 4K. So that will uh, that will definitely change how how you know I operate on YouTube, and it'll give you you know better things to watch than just you know me talking all the time about about whatever. So that that should be pretty good, and I'll even try to film some underwater stuff just to uh, you know just for fun. I've never filmed underwater, so that should be interesting. Yeah. And right now it is Chinese New Year, so there's not as many people as there normally would be. So that's one reason I'm walking around on the street filming. Because normally I wouldn't do this because, you know, someone on a moto will come by and steal my camera or my phone. So, yeah, I just don't want to give them that opportunity. So I'm very aware of my surroundings when I'm out here. So I don't recommend doing this on a normal day. But, you know, if you're paying attention, you should be safe. Don't look, you know, vulnerable, and you'll be okay. Yeah. So, other than that, that's really all I wanted to say. Just give you a quick update on on what's going on with me. And um, yeah, other than that, I will talk to you later.